My hope for those living with HIV and AIDS is that they all get antiretrovirals so they remain healthy, so they don't spread it, so they don't orphan their children. But my real hope is a cure. I, I want to see that breakthrough happen. But I don't want the lessons that we learned in the old days to ever be forgotten. The biggest misconception back then was and still is, it'll never happen to me. So it's not the red flag that it was, it's something people have been hearing about for 30 years. So it doesn't have the resonance that it, it once did when it was the new disease of the century. You have enormous scientific accomplishment, you have enormous scientific potential. That's the good news. The bad news is we have tens of millions of people not in care. We have lots and lots and lots of new infections, you know, more than 50,000 a year in the United States of America alone, which is unthinkable and unnecessary. I think people think it's gone away, but here we are with still 34 million people HIV positive in the world. And here we are, you know, with this extraordinary opportunity where we can end it. I know we're getting closer. And I hear about it, I read about it, it's talked about, it's exciting. We're getting closer to a cure. It's a worldwide pandemic. So there's a lot of work to do. And so the closer we get, it just, it's, there's years and years of work ahead in getting whatever breakthroughs we've got into the hands of everybody who needs it. I have always gotten out of bed in the morning because I believed, I allowed myself to believe that we would cure it. If I didn't believe that, I would never get up. I said to my mom, you know, what do we do if I'm cured? <laughs> and uh, she said, you know, we move on to the next thing. Uh, we, we go help, help with another cause, you know, help with another disease. Um, but it would be an incredible thing to live to, live to that day and to, sorry. My hope that those of us who are living with the virus might someday have it eliminated from our bodies and my hope that someday no one, no one will be HIV positive.